Hi, my name is Susan Woods, and my novel is What the Living Do, which was published by Regal House Publishing in 2024. I'm going to read a short passage from the novel. This is after my main character, Brett, finds out she has cancer. She's told her partner, and she needs to go for a run with her dog, Beckett. After putting Beckett in the bathroom, oh yes, he's been skunked. After putting Beckett in the bathroom, I drive to the grocery store. When I walk in through the swoosh of automatic doors into the ice cool, all heads turn toward me, their faces in an array of shock, disgust, and amusement. I'm putting the last of three large cans of tomato juice in my basket when Cole appears at the end of the aisle. He starts to laugh but stops by the applesauce about ten feet away. Beckett, he calls down the aisle. I nod. I had hoped that at least I'd stop smelling it after a while, but it continues to waft around me just as the singe of Goldie's hair did. Cole takes a few steps and stops two feet away. A rose by any other name, he says. It's intolerable, my smell. I have to get out of this cold store, out of this town, this country, out of sacrificial animals, out of my own skin. I gotta go, I say without looking at him. Cole takes a long step back. Waving a hand in front of his face, he says, good idea. I nod, keeping my head down. I have to get out. So you said. Bali, I say. Bali? That's extreme, he says. Then he brightens. What about a week in Mexico or Cuba? That'd be cheaper. I grip the handles of the basket until I feel them cut into my palms. I don't want to go for a week. I want to go forever. There's a pause before he laughs. The air conditioning blasts into the too bright store and my basket is too heavy. There's a crescent-shaped splotch of something creamy on Cole's apron. Behind him, a woman with slitty eyes and lank gray hair absorbs herself in a label on a jar of pickles. He is so beautiful, so kind, so young. I can't do this. I can't go, and I can't stay. One can dream, right? I offer a laugh I hope sounds genuine. When your first album goes platinum, okay? His whole body softens as he lets out his breath. When you're all better, we'll go. Before his hand reaches my arm, he retracts it. You'd better go get cleaned up. His laugh is relieved, grateful. I'm starting to feel a bit nauseous. Maybe it's the skunk, or maybe it's on account of whatever's festering inside. We'll talk when you get home, okay? I promise. We'll discuss options. I stretch my mouth into a smile, like grown-ups. The thin woman with the pickles hasn't moved. When I lean in to kiss Cole, he takes a step back. We both laugh. It's a good feeling. The pickle woman sticks her thumb up in a sign of approval. There's a lot of sugar in those, I tell her. Maybe try kosher dills. Get the book, read more.